Welcome to this channel. This channel is for education and culture. It is based on scientific and historical evidence. So for those friends who do not want to face the truth by evidence, please do not continue on to watch this video. Today, I am going to share with you an extremely critical issue in Wing Chun today, which is based on the Wing Chun 1960s or Wing Chun version 1960s. What I'm going to share with you is extremely serious. If this issue is not solved, we can predict there is no Wing Chun left. It is this serious. Now, today is uh, October 9th, 2021. Almost get into our Thanksgiving, Christmas, and then another year pass. Time flies and life is short. Suddenly things change. Suddenly 20 years fly away. Suddenly, 60, 70 years fly away. So, if we do not know what is going on, we know that Wing Chun is in a serious problem where it will vanish very soon. Now, today, I make this video not to push my belief, not to push my, uh, my, my evidence, but to open up a conversation. Because Wing Chuners need to, 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 to have conversations conversation so that things flowing, information is flowing, and that become a life, improvement, all sort of stuff, all sort of good positive magic can happen. Now, if it is just to push my belief, my religion, you know it is going to go down. Now, I have been trying to communicate since 2017, start in Asia. And then the book Wing Chun Matrix comes up. There are many, many friends left me. And this is... Uh, Uh, well-known friends and uh, uh, well-known traditional Chinese martial arts. They left me. And then they uh, some saying that they uh, don't want me to mislead the future generations. Uh, they want the uh, Wing Chun, the proper Wing Chun, according to them. And yet, today is 2021. It has been 2017 until here is about four years already. A lot of things happened. 2018, you got the Xi Xiaodong issue with Ding Hao on Wing Chun. And then a year later, you got the Li Gang again fighting Xi Xiaodong, and you guys see the result. 
So this is a critical issue that if people don't communicate, don't go look into the issue and solve it, that means it is a dead end. Today, I'd like to share with you something which is really the, the, the root, the key of the, the, the issue, the key of the 1960s version of Wing Chun's issue. And that is, if you go to Google, then people talk about Wing Chun's base or the seeds of Wing Chun is Tan Pong Fu. You look into the Google, you can see many people wrote about this Wing Chun Tan Pong folk and so forth, so forth, so forth, like magic. And it is in the movie, like the uh, Grandmaster. So today we want to look at it. Is Wing Chun Tan Pong folk? which is promoted by the version 1960s of Wing Chun, or today's Wing Chun in general? Is it or is it not? So let's look at it based on history, based on reality. Now, there is a law or a science of fighting arts. A law or a science of fighting arts. Okay? If you violate that, you know you are not going to make it. So, this is a universal fighting science, universal fighting law, or if you like, you can say universal fighting model. If you violate that, you are looking for trouble. So, 460 years ago, General Chi Ji Guang have already presented this universal fighting science or law or model. So, I have translated what General Chi Ji Guang meant here in details. This is the first book in the West that it tells what exactly is Jenna Chi Ji Guang means based on evidence. So what Jenna Chi Ji Guang present is if you want to get into fighting, see at that time Jenna Chi Ji Guang is facing the Japanese pirate who which invade the 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 the, the, the China and the Bing the Ming dynasty so the you got thousands of soldiers, you cannot handle a few hundreds of a, of a Japanese pirate. And within the Japanese pirate, in the history we know, they are Japanese warrior. The Ming Dynasty army cannot handle it. So that's why Chi Chi Guang want to reform. And Chi Chi Guang found out and that's why he formulated this in his very short chapter on the reality of making war to fight. This is not uh, going up to the ring. If you lose, you still can go home. This is something if you lose, you'll never go home. So there are five things, five laws which is uh, General Chi Chi Guang's summarize it or present it. Or you can say this is a one law. There are five, uh, uh, five uh, elements there, or you can call it the, 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 uh, the, the model with the five parts. Doesn't matter. The content is this. Number one. 
Fighting is a game of momentum play. Fighting is a game of momentum play. Okay. Momentum as today in physics must multiply by velocity. And fighting is a momentum play. Now, this is really Chinese because this momentum play is based on, it can be tracked to Sun Zhi, the art of war. The Chinese is being playing momentum since Sun Zhi time when we make war, when they make war. So fighting is a momentum game. Like it or not, that's what it is. Okay, now how to play this momentum game? The first key is, it is attack base, attack base, not defending base, attack, okay, or attack focus, that's number one key. It say that in, in, in Chinese, General Chi Ji Guang say, 不招不架只是一下, do not parry, do not resist, you strike him, strike him out, that's number one. If you want to play this momentum game, the first thing is you need to be in attack base. Do not block, do not resist. You strike him out with one strike. That is what the idea has to be. The second thing is one momentum transfer or convert to another momentum or one momentum change to another momentum in the three-dimensional space. For example, if the opponent attack you, you don't want to block, you don't want to resist, you want to change to another momentum use a clean strike or clean, a, a, a clean momentum attack to take him out. It is a momentum play, okay? So again, the opponent attack you, you just change within the three-dimensional space using one momentum to attack him, to take him out. That's the idea. Now, if that uh, uh, doesn't take him out because the opponent is changing too, you change. He's going to change to attack you, you're going to change, attack him until the entire thing ends. Okay, so this is the second key. The third key is those who got hit, those who get strike, take the strike, is those who do not know about how the strike come in. For example, if one throwing a punch, the opponent is not going to block that punch. The opponent is going to go close to take down. Okay? get in to take down. Now, if one have no idea on this, how the, the takedown play, one will get takedown. If one have an idea of how this takedown play, one will switch into another momentum to attack the opponent who is trying to do or attempt to do a takedown. So one need to know that what is the, the strike? What is the takedown? That's the third key. The fourth key is speed is the bottom line. If the opponent can do can attack with twice the speed of us. There's no way one can do anything at all because he is 2x the speed. Before one even can move, can, can shift, one got it already because again, 
is NV, mass multiplied by velocity. And, and, and you see how, how, how big is the momentum if the speed is 2x and how quick that thing. So moment, uh, so General Chi Chi Guang present this five things, which I just present to you. First, fighting is a momentum game. And you have the second is key one. It is an attack focus. You must not go defend here, defend there. That's why, that's why I say put out, put out. And it is all also say, if you try to uh, the, the block and resist, then you will end up tangled there. It's a mess. Okay, that's what Chi Chi Guang said, not what I said. Okay, that's why it is uh, it is in the in 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 this book. And then it is one momentum change to another momentum for attack within the three D space. And then if one do not know the way of uh, attack, one will lose. It's just like if one have no idea on what is a takedown and keeping thinking one straight punch can 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 do all the thing. Well, the last one is speed. This is what General Chi Chi Guang present 460 years ago. Now look at it today in Western boxing. Isn't it Western boxing base is fulfilling all this? It is a momentum base and it is a attack focus. Just look at our Western boxing friend who throw a jab, changing the directions, throw a cross, or a hook and keeping changing within the 3D space. One momentum change another momentum. And if you don't know how that thing, that that, that hook or that, uh, that setup is coming in, you're going to get hit. Same thing if we look at our, say, our Thai boxer friend. It is attack base, forward kick, round kick or sweep kick side kick it is all momentum base it is a focus base is attack focus base nobody is going to parry you or blocking you or dissolve your energy for the mma is even more right because mma is a mix of Western boxing, Thai boxing. So that is the, 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 the universal law of General Chi Chi Kong 460 years ago. Now, if you want to look at the Chinese martial art today, say Choi Lei Fa, Hong Sing Choi Lei Fa, which is using in real life, in military and so forth, for past 100 years. Their base is so, the sweep, gua, and then cha. All attack base, momentum changing angle. If you look at the Shaolin Sword Strike and 1850s Wing Chun, same thing. It fit the General Chi Chi Guang's the uh, universal fighting signs or law or model, whatever you want to call it. Okay, so that's the reality of fighting. If you want to talk martial art, that's what it is. Now ask the questions. Ask the questions. What is Tan Pong Fu? 
What is some Tan Bong Fo? If you go up to Google in Chinese, somebody was talk about this is the, the hand techniques will cover many, many things in fighting. It's called Tan Bong Fo or Wing Chun. There's a seat of Wing Chun. Some will say this is the power generations. Some will say this is the uh, it be able to dissolve your energy, come in, all sort of stuff. Now ask the question again. So how is this, be it the hand techniques, attack, uh, uh, hand techniques in a counter attacks and uh, the power generations and neutralize force fit into the general Chi Chi Guang's universe's fighting law. How is it? How is it you practice your Xiu Lim Tao based on your Tan Bong Fu? Got anything to do with or can help to solve or to 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 uh to implement something which is uh which is uh, uh which is fulfill the general chi chi guang's law of fighting how is this hand techniques this dissolve your energy this listening to your energy this uh fa jing this internal be able to solve the problem of General Chi Chi Guang's present or fulfill the ability which is General Chi Chi Guang present in the law of fighting. How is it? Or it is completely living in a different world. Where it really do not solve the problem. So General Chi Chi Guang have his uh, universal fighting law is uh, telling that five things. It is a momentum game. You have four keys there. You want to fight, you need to, to train to develop that skill to handle this this uh, this five thing in momentum play so you know what it is exactly now if if if, if you look at this we know right away tan pong fu got nothing to do with general chi chi guang's law of uh fighting it doesn't fit in it's just living in different world And while you look at Thai boxing, Western boxing, MMA, it all fit into Jena Chi Chi Kuang's uh, science of fighting. The Choi Lei Fat is there, fit into that. And uh, Wing Chun 1850 or Salyun Sok Strike by evidence is fit into that. In fact, they're playing big time on the momentum, the recycling of momentum. And, and General Chi Chi Guang playing big time on the different type of momentum. Different type of momentum and different type of momentum changes. So how is Tan Pong Fu going to solve all this? Or it doesn't? So this is what I like to share with you. This is a reality. See? That's why I say it need to have a conversation now. It is this serious. It is this critical. Your Wing Chun can get wiped out if you stick with the 1960s Wing Chun idea of uh, Tan Bong Fu is the seeds of Wing Chun 
No, it is not. By the ancient Chinese martials. The, 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 the Chinese martial art tradition or teaching. While General Chi Chi Guang's tradition and Chi teaching, it is suitable, it is uh, fit into today's martial arts. 460 years, nothing changed. So this is what I like to share with you. I know that this might be like an earthquake. But this is what you face. This is the problem of 1960s Wing Chun. It has lost the core of the ancient traditional Chinese martial art, namely General Chi Chi Guang's teaching, which is in the real life. With all those energy, and so far later, people add in, it's like those uh, in the Tai Chi or internal, it is, it is not what it is, the ancient Chinese present. And, and if you are thinking that way, you're living in those, kind of, uh, those kinds of, uh, uh, of world, it is expected to get the result Whenever, whoever fights Xu Xiaodong, it's just reality. So, finally, sure, people can keep believing in like a, a decade, a, a hundred years ago that the world is flat because they have a religion belief that the world is flat. Everybody will get hanged if uh, they against uh, the, 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 the world is flat. But too bad the world is not flat. And the world is not about religions. No religions can control human. Look at today. Can, will anybody still say that the world is flat? So does Wing Chun. You think 60 years from today, people still saying that Wing Chun is Tan Pong Fok? If Wing Chun survives 60 years from today, it will not be. Actually, 60 years ago, Bruce Lee already said it. It's a dry land swimming. Go read Bruce Ladder. That's why he do not practice Wing Chun anymore. In his words, in his letter, 1969, if I'm not wrong. So this is this urgent. It's not about blaming. It's about looking at things seriously and start the conversations. It is time to reform, to evolve. Now, if Asia do not be able to, 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 to be in a democratic conversation, then the United States has to start. As we know that in past 100 years, even like uh, at, the, uh, at, the, uh, at the beginning of anti uh, overthrown the Qing dynasty. Din Sun Yat-sen is starting out with America, in America. Din Bruce Lee is uh, starting the idea in America. And then others will follow around the world. So this is what I'd like to share with you. And no, I'm not a grandmaster. I just present you today what is in China Chi Chi Guang's books, what is in the Shaolin Short Strike, which is following General Chi Chi Guang, and what is the, 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 the 1850s Wing Chun, which is following Shaolin Short Strike from following General Chi Chi Guang. And it is a court to today's uh, martial arts. And there are still people in China today, 
Yes, Sifu in China, they will agree with this. They will say, if you watch in YouTube, many will say today's Chinese martial people, most do not understand what is the ancient Chinese martial anymore. 